Welcome back everyone to the Zombie Sound Quiz. This is Quiz 8. Today I'm joined by the one and the only, the zombie extraordinaire himself, Greg FPS. How are you doing, my man? I'm doing very well. Excited to be here. I always like doing zombie quizzes, so I'm excited to see what sounds you have prepared for this one. I hope I've got everything really up to par just for you here. And it is an absolute pleasure to have you on. So thank you for taking the time out of your day to come and do this. I really appreciate that. And yeah, my pleasure. So a brief reminder for everyone at home about the rules of this. I will leave the question sheet down in the description as well as a pinned comment for you guys with timestamps to each question so you can easily find the one that you want. I will read out the question once. Greg will then go out and listen to the sound. He can listen to it as many times as he wants. He tells me his final answer by saying final answer and he has one use of a lifeline which he can ask me for a hint on a specific question with also we do have a current champion on the quiz which is jack he is on 13 points right now greg do you reckon you can beat jack i'm gonna say that i'm gonna tie him for now all right well with that all being said if you're ready, greg we'll jump straight into this all right yeah let's do it all right here we go so let's start this off with question number one which map can a player activate something and hear this sound? That is going to be trapping the Apothkin on Revelations with the Death Ray that's there. Knock on Lancer. That is correct, Greg. It is indeed trapping the giant Apothkin with the Death Ray on Revelation. Question number two. What enemy makes this sound and on which maps can it be heard? It is the Margwa, and it's on Shadows of Evil and Revelation Island. Correct, it is indeed the Margwa, and that is the Margwa spawning in on both Shadows of Evil and Revelations. Question 3. What is a player doing within game to hear these sounds? Really weird. It is shocking the Blood of the Dead number panel and entering numbers on it. Correct. I actually am surprised you got a little stumped on that for a minute. Yeah, I don't like Blood of the Dead as, as much as Mob. So. I, I was stuck on the last part. Yeah, no, it's, it's fair enough. We all try to forget Blood if we're physically possible. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh. A man of true culture. Oh, mate, Mob of the Dead is the best map ever made. I'm just putting that out yeah. there right now. Let's go. Agreed. Question 4. Which gun makes this sound when being shot? That's rough. <laughs> See, it sounds like one gun, and I'm pretty sure it is, but I'm not 100% because it does sound different. And, like, it sounds higher pitched or something. But I'm going to go out on a limb and just go with it. I'm going to say the MP40 final answer. It is not the MP40, no. Is it the STG? No, it's the Browning. Oh, yeah, you're right. From World at War. Yeah, that was a hard question, man, honestly. Question 5. What is making this sound when the player interacts with it? It's a tough one. This is really hard because I think it's the mystery box. I think it's the Shadows one, but it could be Origins. So I'm going to go with opening the mystery box on Shadows of Evil Final Answer. You're correct, Greg. It is indeed. There was a lot of ambience. I could hear the rain, so I knew that it had to be a map that had rain. And the only map that really rains is um, Shadows of Evil and Origins. I know the Origins one is like a stone, but the whip of the tentacle, I could tell that it was. Question six, which map can you hear this ambience music on? You definitely didn't give away some of the other sounds that can be heard when this plays, I think, if I'm thinking of the correct one. It's definitely a lot louder than I remember it. I'm pretty sure that this is the ambient sound of Call of the Dead Final Answer. You're right, oh my yes. god. The first person to get a question six correct. Greg FPS, you've done it. <laughs> <laughs> well done. <laughs> it's my favorite Black Ops 1 map. I've played it a lot, so. Question seven. Which map and where on that map can this radio be heard? Stand up. Stand up. Good. Look at me. Over here. Good. Now walk. 
forward. God, I don't listen to radios very often, so this one might be tricky. Okay, I know what map it is 100%. I'm trying to think like where radios could be on that map. And I literally, I only can think of the spawn. Okay, well, I'm gonna go with Darius for the map. For where? I guess I'll just go with spawn on Darius, final answer. Yeah, you're, you're right on both fronts there. Well done. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, honestly, I don't listen to radios. And I know there's another one coming up from your sheet that you gave me. So <laughs> I got really lucky on that one. But yeah, I don't really listen to radios as much. I just kind of listen to the audio of it. And that's about it. No, that's absolutely fine what you gave me. For the second point of where it's located, I would have accepted other answers as well. Such as it's tucked behind the wall near a barrel. Or it's next to the staircase that leads to the factory part of the map. Or it's near the staircase that leads to the zombie barrier. But either way, the spawn room is perfectly fine. Question 8. What is happening in game for the player to hear this sound? Wow, there's like nothing there. It's short. It's an elevator moving on Dyrise monitor. Correct. It is indeed an elevator moving on die rise. Question 9. When exactly would the player hear this sound in Shadows of Evil? Alright, I'm just gonna go with I think. I'm pretty sure it's get using beast mode, breaking a box, and then coming out of beast mode. You're wrong, Greg. It is not that. Really? The sound that you heard is when the player has finished a ritual or a sacrifice in Shadows of Evil. Oh, yeah, you're right. Dang. It does sound like breaking a box, though. For sure. Question 10. This is a two-point question, and the sound is backwards. Identify the song name and the map it was introduced in. <laughs> That one is, I think I know what it is. I'm going to listen to it again. That song is Carry On from Transit, final answer. Correct. It is indeed Carry On from Transit. <laughs> I did. Th there was like, the only reason I knew this was like 20 seconds into the song when it makes like the particular drum beat. Mm -hmm. And that's the only reason I knew what it was. I had no idea. Like, I knew it was like a fast paced song, but it was so hard to decipher like the words. It, whoa, yes. It, I'm all about like <laughs> melody and like, yeah, that throws me off. Well, that's the first I've ever heard that song backwards before. <laughs> Question 11. What weapon makes this sound when being shot? Another weapon question. Oh, God. Oh, dude. I think I know what this one is, but I'm going to be really upset if you switch it on me like that. I know for a fact it's either Shadow Claws or the one on Dead of the Night. Ooh, this is tough, man. <laughs> I'm going to go with the NX Shadow Claw final answer. You're correct. It is indeed yeah. the Shadow Claws. Question 12. What exactly does a player have to do in game to hear this? What the heck? Shoot the baby gun and kick the zombies. Final answer. On Shangri-La. Correct. It is indeed shooting the baby maker, whatever you want to call the thing. 3179 JGB215. Yep, there we go, that. <laughs> <laughs> That thing, that zombie and kick it in the air. I know you know that freaking name. Question 13. What map can you hear this radio in? The subjects have been undergoing treatment for five days with little progress. I have been assured that given time, the programming will take hold. I'm going to say it is on Kino Der Toten, final answer. Correct. It is indeed on Kino When you place the reel, right? Uh, no, actually, it's when you shoot okay. the radio in the chandelier. Oh, you know what it is? On the Wii version of Kino Der Toten, when you place the reel, it plays it. Question 14. When does Ultimus Richtofen say this quote? You! Oh, scheiße. All right, it's in the round 150 cutscene on Classified. Correct. You already got it. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, like, when the characters come out of the portal. So. Nah, it's fine. I accepted it as soon as you said. Round 150 cutscene. <laughs> Question 15. What weapon is the player using here? 
Sliquifier final answer. That is correct. It is indeed the Sliquifier. Damn, I thought that might catch you out. I thought you might say the KT4 or something. No, you already <laughs> used it on another quiz. You wouldn't reuse it a second time. Very clever thinking. Very clever. <laughs> Damn, he's seeing through my mind. Oh no. <laughs> Question 16. Identify the song and what map it came from. There's no audio or like vocals. Oh man. Ooh, this is tough, man. <laughs> This is really tough. It, it, like, my thought process on this one is like trying to figure out what the beat is. Mm -hmm. But it, since it's backwards, it's like pretty hard to hear. <laughs> and it, I don't think it's Pareidolia because you've already done that on a quiz. I honestly, I'm not really too sure of this one, but I'm going to go with always running from buried final answer. Oh, well, I can tell you one thing. You've got the artist who would be singing it correct. But it is not always Maluka. running. Yeah, it is Maluka, but it is not always running, and it's not buried. It is actually drowning from Voyage of Despair. Oh, yeah, I would have never got that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even think of Black Ops 4. I was thinking of, like, more Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3 styles. Uh, either way, Greg, I think this is probably the most, like, I'm completely speechless in some ways I've ever seen of a quiz. <laughs> Not only have you managed to get question six correct that no one has ever got right, but you have become the new leader on the sound quiz. You got 16 out of 20. 80%, let's go. You beat Jack's 13. You completely just, you smashed this, mate. You absolutely smashed the hell out of this quiz out of the park. Well done. Seriously, well done. Thanks. <laughs> oh. I mean, I play zombies. That was pretty much my job. I know there's a lot more that goes into it than just playing a game. But yeah, I'm glad that I showed up for this quiz. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> well, it proves that you really do think about everything when you're playing zombies. Despite the fact that you might not be trying to think about the sounds, you really do. So, you know, you're paying attention. And this is now your chance to take the floor here. I ask each contestant for recommendations for the next sound quiz or future ones and um, you can recommend someone big you can recommend someone small and you can recommend as many people as you like the floor is yours uh who i'd like to see on the quiz i'd like to see dk dynamite probably take this also like chopper maybe or pizza or dalek like one of them i don't know if they could beat me but yeah that's really all i can think of all of you have been officially challenged by greg to uh, future sound quizzes see if you can beat greg or ty with him who knows you never know let us know how you guys did at home be very interested to see what you got on this quiz as well otherwise thank you greg for taking the time out of your day to come and do this it's really appreciated as i especially know you have a very busy schedule on so thank you yeah i'm glad i could fit it in uh today i'm about to do shadows no <laughs> Greg come and yeah it was a pleasure having you on so with that being said I hope you guys all enjoyed it and I will see you all in quiz 9 see you then but <laughs> it's the voice you hear when you interact with the phone three times in Shino Numa at the comm station, which you actually use to turn on the music Easter egg song, The One. Oh, the music Easter egg songs that I never do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Coming to haunt me.